So what are the trends in fashion today and the future? They just might be coming from students in Idlewild. This Wednesday, you'll get a chance to see some of their work at the 2020 Student Showcase at the Rancho Mirage Library. You'll see the works of more than 40 students here this morning is Jonathan Sharp, Idlewild Arts Director of Artistic Outreach. Also here are two students, A.G. Vaitasa Nova and also uh, Anna Smirnova. Did I get close? <laughs> it's good to have all of you here. This is pretty exciting because uh, you get to showcase not only fashion, but dance and music all in one venue. Tell us about the school. So Idlewild Arts is located um, in the mountains over Palm Springs. It, we have an academy program which brings young artists, very talented artists in seven different disciplines from 32 countries to study year-round. They board at the school, they take their academic classes in the morning, and they do their arts classes in the evening. And we have our show on March 4th, which is going to showcase all of that. All right. So, Anna, what, if you had your dream uh, come true, who would you like to design fashion for? Uh, I would say Alexander McQueen. It's like my favorite ever brand. I love their style, I love their fashion shows. It's just, I'm really inspired by them. So it's as a amazing. child in Russia, were you drawn to fashion from a very young age? I've been studying visual arts since I was, I think, two. And I've also been going to art school in Moscow. I didn't really think to be a fashion designer, uh, but it just came out as it is now. Yeah. And G, how about for you? If, if Who would you like to des design for in this country or anyone in, in, in the world? Uh, I would, wait, would want to make it more international so everyone would, can like, wear my clothes. <laughs> yeah, not only in Kazakhstan or United States, but everywhere. And, and so the thing is, you c not only designing, but you also have to make the clothes too, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah this is not just, you know, Put a few yeah. drawings on paper and then have somebody else do the work. It's You've got to do not that. that easy. It's not that easy. Yeah. Like we have to sew by ourselves. We have to design. We have to do like everything. So like fashion show by itself, it's really complicated. And so, do the teachers in the school do? Are they saying, you know, this this has been done before. We need something fresher. We need something new. Pretty much, yeah. yeah. Pretty much. That's good though, <laughs> isn't it? They like, can say anything, but like. I think everyone in our school is so creative, so it's nothing like the same. It's always something different and unique. Yeah, and uh, with so many people from all different walks of life and different countries, what an exciting school this is. Absolutely. I think it's uh, Disneyland for the arts. <laughs> 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 I would imagine, yeah. So the big event is this coming Wednesday. Yes, at Rancho Mirage Public Library okay. at 7 p.m. We're going to have our student showcase. It is going to showcase not only fashion, but it's going to be fashion focused. We'll have Susan Stein there who um, is from the desert and uh, supports Fashion Week El Paseo. And she's going to be there and we'll, we'll have two fashion shows. And also we're going to be doing a short, cut, a short uh, exhibit of Swan Lake, the pas de deux from okay from Swan Lake, we'll be having some other dance. Um, a pianist is going to play Chopin. So we're gonna focus on all of our school, but with fa fashion as the, the centerpiece. All right, we need to leave it there, but thank you so much for being here, all right? And don't forget, Wednesday is the big day. All right, we're back after this.